I'm getting my... T you have to go to Panchea and stop... You and I aren't done with this, Megan. ...how it looks. But you have to stop the broadcast. I think it's causing the new biostimulate the vagus nerve, creating terraphinations. You mean it's driving Audible insane? Yes. To you to stop it. Use the Leo shuttle. It will take you to Panchea. Good luck, Adam. I did. I'm no. I'm not, I'm not killing. I'm not. And I'm not listening to you. No. <sighs> Automated systems on Darrow sequence 1, code 1A, preset and ready to engage. Suborbital trajected. Destination, Panchea. In countdown, Mr. Darrow. In countdown. Code, zero, zero, zero. Confirm, zero. Countdown commencing.
Jensen. Jensen, can you read me? Barry, I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word from Sarah for the UN delegates? Nothing. The installation went into lockdown short of Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if anyone even alive. And a signal still broadcasting. Meaning no one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. You'll disengage the lockdown first. Look for a master control panel at the top of the tower. Jensen. Jensen, can you read me? Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word of UN delegates? Nothing. The instant into lockdown shortly after Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if anyone's even alive. And the signal's still broadcasting. Meaning no one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. You'll have to disengage the lockdown first. Look for a master control panel at the tower. Jensen. Jensen, can you read me? Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any of the UN delegates? The installation went into lockdown after Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if even alive. No, still broadcasting. Meaning no until I get in there and shut it down. To disengage the lockdown first for a master control panel for the tower.
Pritchard. Pancea's broadcast center is at the base of the station near the bottom of the ocean. Is that right? But the lockdown caused all the blast doors to seal. You won't be able to go down until you override the map. From up in the tower. I got it. That was nothing. Please, let it be nothing. I don't think you want to do that, Mr. Jensen. Disengage lockdown, and whatever demons tains are likely to come crashing out on us. Afraid to die, or just unwilling to done. Oh, I know what I've done, me. I take no pleasure. And yet you still did it. I did what to be done. Twenty years ago, I gave the world augmentation technology. I thought I was giving it a bright future. But instead, I gave it the means to destroy itself. Law. No UN regulation was going to fix that. People are dying out there. Hundreds of thousands of people driven to the brink of insanity because of you. I have world. The fool believed we should steal fire from the gods of human nature. The human nature thing we have that gives us a moral kind of social skills we need to lease. Destroy it, and you destroy our very species. 
Don't paint yourself a savior in this. What you're doing is insane. Is it? When this is done, the Illuminati won't be able to control men and women like you as they had planned from the inside out. No one will be able to be I invented to make others into beings they desire. Then we both know as happy. You think you're a monster? Fully, Mr. Jensen. I prefer to think of myself as dead, watching helplessly as I'll crash us into the sea. I'm ending this. Now. You can't. The signal is being generated from the broadcast center at the base of this facility. Banchea's security system has been programmed to protect it, and will kill you before you even get close. You designed that system, Darrow. You can tell me how to shut it down. But I won't. You think what I'm doing is extreme. You simply don't understand. For humanity to survive beyond this century, it must abandon ill-conceived notions about transcendence and embrace change. But for that to happen, the hard lesson must be learned. Blood must be shed. My God, Darrow, please. Think of the individuals you're hurting. Innocent women and children, some of whom had no choice when they got augmented. Every second that signal continues to broadcast, more of them will die. Help me stop this, please. You think to sway me by forcing me to consider the individuals? I created something magnificent and watched it to ashes. And from my suffering is exactly in play here. A single human being can be a consistable entity, but a mob, a nation, an entire world. Sociological studies have proven time and time again that groups react like packs of animals, driven by anger and fear. Those emotions are the only means through which they can end their danger. Pain is the one reality the world will understand. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're wrong. None of it matters, because this is what will happen now. After today, whatever you say will be dismissed as the ravings of a mass murder. You were one of the greatest minds of our time, and tomorrow you'll be nothing but a killer. Ravings of a mass murderer? When the truth is revealed, when people know why I did this, surely they will understand. Don't you see? I created people. I made it possible for you to happen. If a different hand, then perhaps... Perhaps neither of us would be here. Obvious how fate is now can overtake us both to grind our wheels. Must see this through. Lest people like you continue to evolve and destabilize society. People like me? You mean not like you? It was the world when you invented this technology, but your creation is leaving. And as long as it's allowed to continue, mankind will use it to evolve without you. Until the father of tomorrow, known as yesterday's man. You think I am doing this, Ego? I never did this, any of it. But I had no choice. All of this is academic, Mr. Jensen. As long as this technology exists, men like you and me will still crave it. Still do anything to have it, despite the cost to our body and souls. Well, today, I set the dominoes falling. Change that. I have altered the course of humanity for a second time. And this time, it is setting things right. You cover it up with all that pretense about saving the world. Try to justify it. But deep down inside, you're nothing more than an angry child. Spiteful, full of hate, envious and bitter. How petty is that? How dare you? I'm not the one driven by rage and obsession. I'm not the one chasing the love of a woman who rejected him. You're the weak link, Jensen. Nothing but a genetic fluke. A thug with a gift he was too ignorant to comprehend. You think you're going to save the world? By tomorrow, the world will hate your kind more than I ever could. Kill me if you wish, but I won't give you the security shutdown codes. I regret nothing I have done. 
The technology I created must be destroyed, and this is the only way I know to assure it. Go down there, Mr. Jensen. Go down to the core and see with your own eyes the horrors your precious future creates. I've made my choices. Now you must make yours. Go. See for yourself the f technology offers. I wonder if it will give mess. Does it... Richard, the lockdown's disengaged. I'm heading back to the hangar to see if those blast doors are open. Have you been able to raise anyone? Locking up several glimmers, but there's too much indifference. I, I think you're on your own, Jensen. Careful there, Francis. You almost sound like you regret that. Leave it. 